Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. So today we're gonna try to keep this video as light as possible, as simple as possible, and honestly try to catch some fish as fast as possible. I don't know if you guys can see, walking through puddles, my pants are already wet. We've been getting rain nonstop here in Wisconsin. Day after day after day, we've just been getting rain. So it's really been hard to fish. So I'm hoping that we, we have about an hour to an hour and a half before the next storm is going to hit. And this one is supposed to be a really heavy, really bad, severe thunderstorm. So we're going to try to get out of here as fast as we can. It's not raining too bad anymore. I do have a lot of junk up all over us though now. I'm walking through all this. This rock is slippery as I'll get out. Oh, there's a bass right here. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. Two of them. Bass right here. Two of them. going for it. Got him. There goes my worm. Nice large mouth. Nothing too crazy. This is what we're catching the bass on right now. We got the bass catcher 3000s. We got a random pack right here. Probably gonna go with the watermelon now. That wasn't even English, but whatever. Nice. These rocks in here are so slippery. Around. A lot of small bass in this this pond. There's thunder. That's the thunder we didn't want to hear, so I'm guessing oh I almost just fell. I'm guessing that just means a few more casts for us. So we gotta hit the hay. And we also keep seeing a good amount of them right here. All right, well, we're under a tornado watch till 10 p.m., so we should probably get out of here. It switches to me getting abducted by a tornado. That would be funny. <sighs> Maybe it's just not a watermelon, dude. What? I wasn't paying attention. I was scratching my nose and I just saw a fish just top water right here. There's thunder. All right, yeah, the storm's moving in. We'll give it a few more casts. Also, I guess I didn't mention this the entire video, but some of you might be asking why I'm using this weird looking combo with the, we got the stinking graphite series, Bass Pro Shop rod, and then some random reel that I found in my collection. It's because my other rod, it must've been too hot out. I don't know if you guys watched the video or not. Are you kidding me? I got a fish on and my fishing rod broke. But, oh, I thought we got a fish. My whole, like, this part right here just snapped off. It was so hot out and I had it laying in the sun that when I set the hook on a fish, it just, it just like slowly bent and then just broke off. Something's over here trying to beach itself. Oh my god. That's a bass. Oh my god. That's a bass. That is a bass. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh 
Oh my God. Dude, he won't open his mouth for me. Oh my God. Ah. Oh. He's biting me. Oh my. You idiot. I need a picture with this thing. Almost four pounds. Oh my gosh, are we on? What the heck am I stuck on? I can't tell if we're on. A bunch of weeds. I had one attempt at him and he gave up. I guess right here. Oh, these guys seem to be sitting shallow, like closer to me, like I'm catching them right in front of me. So maybe we don't want to cast too far out. Maybe right, like 20 feet in front of us is like a good distance maybe. starting to rain. I don't want to call it quits, dude. Do a couple more casts. <sighs> Huge fish right there. These fish are going crazy right now. There's a snapping turtle right there. Whole, is that a snapping turtle? Yeah. It was really wide. I was gonna say it might be a beaver. Cause I know there's beavers here. Flying right on top of where that splash was. Just missed him. That's a horrible cast. Well, that might get him right there. That's a good cast. He might. I think he was going that direction. Now we got this fly chasing us. If we're catching a fish right there, it's it's literally going to be pulling us through the weeds. Huge carp right there.
big fish right there. I don't know what it is. I just barely saw its surface. Looked like it was long. Looked like it was probably that bowfin or it's a pike. One of the two. There it is. We're leaving some nice fish behind, but we'll be back, that's for sure. Ugh. All right, we're out of this spot. So once we get back to the truck, I will see you guys there. All right, well, I'd say that was a pretty successful fishing trip. Storm's heading in right now. We're under severe thunderstorm warning and a tornado watch. So I gotta get out of here, it's getting dark, it's about to pour. But like I said, I think it was a pretty successful fishing day. We caught a four pound bass, biggest bass that we've caught this year so far so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you leave a like and subscribe good videos coming in the future it's just been hard to make these videos recently because of all the rain we've been getting should be expecting better videos in the future where we do more challenges together with me and the boys and we just fish together have a good time it's just been raining a lot here in wisconsin like today we're gonna get it yesterday it rained it's been raining for the past couple weeks so it's really been hard to fish and do these videos with the boys but Make sure you leave a like and subscribe so you never miss one of the good videos that we're going to be putting out. But this summer is our summer. I'll see you guys later.